third, third, third brother here. Have you heard about the new game? No, not good enough. Have you heard about the new cool game? No, still not good enough. Have you heard about the new coolest game ever? Oh yeah, that one is good. By the way, I'm talking about Battle Bay. You should stay tuned. Okay guys, sorry for the intro. Anyway, today I got for you the top 15 tips and tricks for Battle Bay. Starting off with some beginner tips, moving on to some intermediate player tips, and lastly, we got some pro tips for you guys out there that are high level and need to know how to move on further, push up the trophies and whatever. Anyway guys, stay tuned. And as usual, in the end of the video, there is the end of the video's joke. So I hope you enjoy and stay around for that. You laugh, maybe. Okay guys, first tip for today. Don't shoot the waves. That's kind of obvious, but keep that on your mind. When the aiming circle turns green, that means there's no waves interrupting between you and the player, the enemy, like the shot. So keep that on your mind. Tip number two, use waves for your advantage. guys. Being up high on a wave makes it much easier to shoot the enemy and also being down below like between two big waves makes it a lot harder for them to hit you. So know how to use them for your advantage. That can help you a lot. And also moving from a big wave downwards will help you gain speed. So always aim down. That's the best way to avoid attacks very quickly because the faster you are, the harder it is to hit you. Tip number three for today is move sideways while shooting. Don't just aim at him straight and just shoot. Always turn to your right or to your left, aim sideways to him and shoot while moving forward and sometimes even move forward, back, whatever you want. That can help a lot by him missing shots if he has a cannon, if he has a mortar. He can miss so many shots, torpedo, that's very hard to hit with a torpedo. So. Just move sideways, that's a lot better. Tip number four, keep your eyes on the map. Be sure you aren't surrounded, because most of the maps are a circle. So let's say you're going straight ahead and going to the capture point. Many battles, the enemies will come and surround you. If you see some uh, on your left and on your right, know that you're not in a good position, that they can shoot you from both sides. So keep your eyes on the map. Tip number five, guys, watch some ads. I mean, inside the game, not talking about my channel or any ads at all. Talking about Battle Bay. Yeah, that's kind of obvious. Anyway, guys, watch some ads. After the match, you have an option to gain 50% plus, plus, plus. After the match, after the match, you have 50% bonus um, gold, sugar, and pearl. A bonus pearl or two sometimes in the end of the video I got three pearls so that's kind of great anyway you gain cool bonuses that can make you stronger a lot faster so watch some ads my rule of thumb is when the ads um, bonus reaches above 10,000 so I always watch the ad and also if I gain one pearl and I want to get the two pearls for one match that's also kind of cool so have your own rule of thumb for when to watch an ad and when not to watch an ad because watching an ad on every single loss is kind of a waste of time. So keep that on your mind. Tip number six, buy everything in the shop, in the market, shop, market, whatever. Buy everything there. Even if you don't own an epic item, that's still very useful for a head to buy epic mater materials, materials. Epic materials, 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 materials. You will eventually need a lot of materials to progress further. So buying ahead from now, even epic materials will help you so much further on. So do that and always check the market, get the epics after that, get the rares after that. You can take the uncommon and common if you need so. Tip number seven, use the chat. As soon as the match starts, as soon as the match starts, 
as soon as we begin, yeah, that's much better. As soon as we begin, I always ping together. I always even shoot my allies to mention for them, let's go together. In every match that all five of us grouped up five together, we won so easily because if they scatter around, so only one of them will find five of you and five of you will kill him down. So you keep the progress through the map and you get one more kill, one more kill, one more kill, one more kill, and one more kill. Five kills. That's the match. So go together, group up guys. That's very important. Tip number eight. Keep your crew always training. That's very important because first of all, it gives you XP, which levels you up and you have much better um, storage of sugar and gold for for buying better items and whatever and upgrading better stuff and besides that each crew member and each crew members ability gives you a cool bonus if it's 50 health or whatever that's very useful so keep your crews training and read before you train your crew maybe there's something down there that you need so it's worth the effort to train him more and more and more to get that bonus that you need tip number nine if while aiming at someone it says three two one whatever range too much you can shoot like me personally i use cannons as you can see in the video here i use the cannon and every time there is like two range too much too far away i still shoot and i still hit so try that you don't need to be exactly on the green circle to shoot Notice that and that will help you a lot. Sometimes you won't be able to get to green circle aiming whatever. So shoot even while it's one or two or sometimes three. So good luck with that. Tip number 10. Hide under the big waves and shoot above them. With mortars, grenades and even cannons, you can just simply hide under the waves not being able to get shot by the enemy and yet being able to hit somebody else from under a big wave or something like that. I always aim for these low spots between two big waves because that's the best defensive gameplay, being able to stay alive as a shooting ship and also because I already trained so much for shooting above a big wave. So keep that on your mind if you guys like it, do it, if you don't, just get killed. Tip 11. You can hit above certain objects like icebergs or just some random metal that they put in the map with mortars or even um, cannons sometimes. Use a big wave to like get so high up that you can hit above an iceberg and you get a clean shot and then just go down and the enemy won't even be able even to hit you back. Tip 12. Ping attack while aiming at someone that also puts a mark, uh, a target mark above him. Let's say your team is a bit confused and each one is attacking somebody else. Look at a fixer, look at a squishy ship, a ship with not a lot of health. You can aim at it and just ping attack. That gives your team a better chance to know who to focus and just win. Tip 13. Scrapping a level 21 uncommon or common and scrapping a level 11 rare items will give you an epic power cell. That's very important for those of you reaching high up with um, so many epic items and wanting to upgrade them and evolve them. So note that reaching level 21 or 11 if it's rare items will guarantee while scrapping it an epic power cell. For you pro players out there keep that in mind tip 14 don't always auto shoot sometimes let's say the enemy is moving this way you should press and hold and slightly move to your left or to your right depends on his movement speed and direction you calculate the distance that he's from you and also the direction that he moves because don't forget the projectile takes a few milliseconds or whatever how much to get to the enemy ship so let's say he's moving left so quickly don't shoot where he is shoot a bit to your left so that when the projectile get to him he's already moved to that point 
And tip 15, last tip for today guys, turn up the music. Guys, the music in the app is so cool, it's so, I don't know, it gets me hyped up uh, during the battle. So turn it up and enjoy guys, enjoy the game and I hope you enjoyed this video as well. So I hope I was able to help you out with these tips and tricks for Battle Bay. I have a cool ideas for future Battle Bay videos as well as we are on my channel if you're not familiar with my channel. So thank you all for subscribing and liking this video. I'm waiting. <laughs> anyway guys, the end of the video's joke. What do you call a guy with a rubber toe? Roberto! <laughs> Anyway guys, thank you all for watching and as usual, Third Brother here, signing out. See ya and thanks for watching. Starting off with some beginner... Stay around for that. You laugh. Maybe. Use the map. You can map. You can map. You can map. That's very important. Important. Tip 12, 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 wow again. And as usual, the end of the video's joke. What do you call a rubber toe with a rubber toe? <laughs>